Welcome back. And in our business news, His Highness Sheikh Ahmed bin Saeed Al Maktoum has announced a 132% rise in net profit for Dubai Silicon Oasis for the first half of the year, up from the same period last year. Additionally, the chairman, Sheikh Ahmed, revealed that the results were driven by a 53% rise in operating profits and that the DO, DSOA has witnessed a 39% increase in its total revenues as compared to the same period last year. The total number of companies operating out of DSO reached 740, marking a 39.5% increase at the close of 2011. Out of the total DSO-based companies, 67% are in the technology sector, nearly 32% are European firms, while American companies account for 11%, and Asian companies make up close to 19%. The world's tallest residential building is now ready for occupancy, according to Tamir, a leading real estate developer in the Middle East. The 414-metre Princess Tower has more to offer its residents, other than holding an impressive title as the tallest residential building, beginning with a panoramic view from its 97th floor. Occupying a land area of 37,410 square feet, it has six basement levels, a ground floor and 100 levels of luxury penthouses, bedrooms as well as typical units and retail spaces on the ground floor. 957 parking bays add to the convenience. According to Tamir, the 1.5 billion dirham property is a vertical village that allows its residents to commune and enjoy facilities such as indoor and outdoor recreational areas for both adults and children free of charge. Situated in the Dubai Marina, it has easy access to hotels, beach resorts, shopping malls, universities and schools. Eight residents have already moved into their new home. And company officials say that 98% of the 763 units have already been sold, with the majority of the owners from Saudi Arabia and a significant mix of Europeans and Asians. A positive sign that Dubai's property market is strengthening. In the last few months of 2011, and uh, uh, more visibly in the first few months of 2012, uh, demand has been increasing. So we have seen demand increasing and prices have been growing up very visibly in uh, most of the important locations in Dubai. Um, we have seen increases in prices from 30 to 40 percent. So uh, this is accelerating actually. Um, I think that. Uh, uh, Today is uh, feasible to, to launch a new project in Dubai. Uh, if you have a good location and uh, what is it, you know, uh, affordable for the market. And let's now take a look at the stock indices across the GCC.